Hey everyone, how's it going? Got another episode of Buffy the Vampire Slayer to check out. This is now Season 2, Episode 3. The last episode kind of had a Frankenstein vibe to it. It was pretty interesting. This one is called School Hard, so I'm wondering what this one's going to be about. If you want to see the full-length reaction to this and everything else that I check out, you can check out the link to my Patreon. It'll be in the description. If not, check back every week for the sort of shortened highlight reel version here on YouTube. Cannot wait to check it out, so here we go. She alone will stand against the vampires. The de she alone. I'm loving the new Giles narration. I see. Think of me as your judge, jury, and executioner. <laughs> he's so creepy, but he's still kind of funny. We'll meet your teachers, assuming you have any left. Dang. I decided to put the two of you in charge of this event. It's like a competition. I'm clear. Don't you feel clear? We're very clear. He's going to trust these two with that? <laughs> okay. That's one way to uh, be the principal. As long as nothing really bad happens between now and then, you'll be fine. Are you crazy? What did you say that when nothing bad is gonna happen? What do you mean nothing's gonna happen? Not until some dummy says, as long as nothing bad happens. It's the ultimate jinx. What were you thinking? He's what cursed them. Thinking? Well, you guys don't know. Maybe this time it'll be different. Way to go. Oh, well, probably not. Is it the Terminator? <laughs> Crossover episode. Whoa, edgy vampire. Looks like Billy Idol or that guy who was in uh, No Doubt or something. What's gonna happen? There was that dance, famous dance. I fell off a flower person and I spent the next six hours watching my hand move. Were you on something, sir? Spike. His name is Spike. Of course it's Spike. There was this one slayer during the Boxer Rebellion. Uh... Drusilla. Whoa, change back. You shouldn't be walking. I thought that was Cordelia for a second. Look at all the people. All She's like Snow White or something. Everything I put in the ground withers and dies. Why is she so quiet? Spike, I'm cold. Or understated. That's what you are. Oh. All right. I'll do your slayer for you. And you keep your flunkies from trying anything behind my back. Deal? I can't see her. He's gonna take on Buffy. Kill of the princess. I'll chop her into messes. Or will you? What I don't want is to be disappointed in you again. Mom, it's the last thing that I want too. Do you want you burning down another school? I have a lot of pressure on me right now. Wait till you get a job. Sleep tight. She kind of has a job. Holy water. I have a job. Aha. I knew it. Because of how you thought Angel might show? If he does, he meets some other nice girl. Studying comes first. We're going to the bronze. I feel like that's the second Scooby-Doo shirt I've seen. Am I imagining things? As long as I don't have to... Buffy. ...fight vampires. There is nothing in the Chronicles about an extraneous lunar cycle. Nope. Giles and the techno-pagan Miss Calendar? That's her name, right? I'm learning names. And you are, after all, the slave. <clears throat> slave... Slaves. You're, you're all slaves to the uh, television. Yes. Uh, young people nowadays. Nice save, Giles. <laughs> no. We're hindering. She ditched. Hmm. I feel an expulsion coming on. Like, what did you expect? Oh, is there no more teal in the art room? I know you wanted everything to be perfect, but let's just go with what we have. Just make sure every- Wow, she's actually covering for her. Did you really burn down a school building one time? Well, not actually one time. Cool. All right. Of course, you would be impressed by that. This band's a little more upbeat than the last band. Well, we are studying. Come on, one dance. You've been studying only 12 minutes. No wonder my brain's fried. Uh oh. The dance part two. Spike. 
Where's Angel when you need him? I thought he was just always lurking. No, he didn't do anything. I need to call the police. There's some big guy out there trying to bite someone. Well, that was easy. Oh, but there really is, because he sent him. Okay. Did you just send that guy out there to be killed? Maybe he's impressed. Uh, I saw what she did there. Spike, give me a hand. Oh, he said, Spike, give me a hand. Is that gonna come into play? You find out on Saturday. Happens on Saturday. I kill you. Oh, okay. He's just gonna. He's just gonna come right out with it. He could have totally uh, been like undercover. He doesn't even look like a vampire. I guess he's just that confident. And you got something a whole lot better. Are they gonna team up? He's worse. Once he starts something, he doesn't stop. There is Angel. Wow, two centuries of dating. If you only had two a year, that's still like 400 dates with 400 different... Why do they call it a mate? <laughs> Let's talk about something else. Angel, do you know if this Spike fellow goes under any other name? Okay, that's it. I'm putting a collar with a little bell on that guy. <laughs> and he's out. She's a bad example. And we'll have no cakes today. What is her deal? The hell mouth will restore you. Put color in your cheeks. Oh, they, they kidnapped her. They follow him. I think sometimes that all my hair will fall out and all be bored. Seems like she's hypnotized or something or, or some trance. The way she's talking. Or she's just weird, I don't know. You see, Miss Edith, if you'd been good, you could watch with the rest. Whoa! A vampire. Willow with a weapon. They all have weapons. Three nights, the unholy one scourge. She's making some veggies. Does anybody remember when Saturday night meant date night? You oh, it's Cordelia. Had a moisturize. Did it like skip a generation? Well, I believe that I have. Jeez. And you know that's really interesting. What with the boiler being in the room and all. Hi. <sighs> well. How's this gonna go? Spike has fought two slayers in the last century and he's killed them both. He's taken down slayers. In the car, now. It's gotta be like a fake out, right? She set everything up? Oh, but he probably went over like all the stuff. Whoa. There's a siege on the school. What can I say? Good mic. Oh, great. Are y'all gonna watch her take him down? Did I actually knock them out? Well, this should get her some kudo points with the principal. I'm a real kind of guy. You're too old to eat. But not to kill. Dang. I feel better. Bad guy stuff. Didn't get much of a look, but is there something wrong with their faces? I yes. BCP. It's a gang on PCP. <laughs> We've got to get out of here. A BCP gang. Until I say so, do you hear me? Who do you think you are? Oh. I'm the one that knows how to stop them. I'm the Slayer. Well, then, I guess the danger's over. I'm not waiting for them to open the doors. I'm getting out. But don't be an idiot. I'm beginning to see a certain mother-daughter resemblance. <laughs> Thank you. Gosh. They're turning on each other. I did it! Oh, that guy's totally gonna die, right? Okay. Of course, that's why he went first. <laughs> you know a lot about the Spike guys, so, um... You got a plan? Good plan. I think he's gone. 
Oh, what's the plan? That's a cool image. Or a cool way that was shot. Caleb, where have you been? Sorry, I'm late. There's some really weird guys outside. Is she a vampire now? This should be fun. What's going on with her? Angeles! <laughs> Spike! Oh, he's gonna pretend. <laughs> I guess Spike doesn't know. I know you're lying. <laughs> Undead liar guy. <laughs> Liar guy. Stay behind me. Hopefully he doesn't actually do it. Oh, I knew it. Uh-oh. Hopefully she has some good reflexes. Oh. That was like the second off-camera shot. It's kinda cool. So, why are you so scared of this Slayer? You scared? Yeah. Time was you would've taken her out in a heartbeat. Now look at you. I mean, this uh, torture thing is an act, right? You're not housebroken. Uh oh. Is he catching on? Oh, did he know? You think you can fool me? Oh. He did. You were my sire, man. You were my Yoda. Things change. Not my Yoda. This isn't a spectator sport. <laughs> Sander has the right idea. It's like, I'm out of here. Do we really need weapons for this? I just like them. Oh, how's this fight going to go? Just fists and kicks. Come on, everyone. Ooh. This way. Look, like it's gonna be a good fight. We got dual fights going on. Oh. Is that her mom? You oh. get the hell away from my daughter. The mother of the slayer. Nobody lays a hand on my little girl. Well, isn't that sweet? Take care of this. Of course, she didn't actually kill him, so he'll be back, I'm sure. Can't introduce a character like that and not bring him back. Body inside, and I got another one on the south lawn. It looks like he was pulled right through the window. Told him not to go through there. Okay. He's covering his tracks. I will understand if you decide to start avoiding me. Aww. Look at them. And if he bit me, what then? We would have known he bought it. <laughs> yeah, what's the deal with you being Spike's sire? What's a sire? <laughs> I need to say something. Always great lines. Always amusing. Gang related PCP. Do they know? What did you and Principal Snyder talk about anyway? That was interesting. How they were talking. And thinks of others in a crisis. No matter who you hang out with or what dumb teenage stuff you think you need to do. Oh, like the music and their conversation right now. It's like the ending of a uh, superhero movie, like of Spider-Man or something. I don't know. And if you get me out of this, I swear I'll never be mean to anyone ever. Oh, they're still in there? So. How's the annoying one? He doesn't want to play. The annoying one. I offer penance. Penance? You should lay down your life. Our numbers are depleted. The Feast of St. Vigus has been ruined by your impatience. He's like, no, I don't think I will. Exactly the same. Only I'd do this. No! Oh, who's he doing? Taking out the kid? I was just throwing him in there. What the heck? Did that just take him out because he saw the light? He's just gone? 
that's just the end of that storyline. All right. Okay. All right, so that was season two, episode three of Buffy the Vampire Slayer. I really liked the episode. I thought the new bad guy, Spike, was pretty interesting. And I guess by the end of the episode, the anointed one, or the annoying one, as he called him, is just gone. He was pretty much there since the beginning of the show, or at least a few episodes in, with the Master. And it seemed like he was going to kind of take over when the Master died in that one episode. And I thought he was going to carry on. He was going to grow up and everything and become like the leader. And now, just at the end of one episode, he's just gone, apparently. So so that was kind of a shocking ending and now I guess Spike is going to be the new main bad guy unless the anointed one or uh, the master comes back in a later episode who knows and this show has had a few episodes like that where at the very end it just totally throws me off and totally surprises me with the ending uh, there was that one with the invisible girl and how they're training a bunch of them to become assassins or something like that and there was probably a few other episodes and this one just had that really shocking ending where now it's like no we're gonna throw away what we were doing before and this is the new bad guy so at the very least that's pretty surprising writing for the show and I'm sure the show is just going to continue to throw me off and come up with new surprises so I can't wait to check out the rest of the show if you want to see the full-length reaction to this and everything else that I check out you can check out the link to my patreon it'll be in the description if not check back every week for the sort of shortened highlight reel versions here on YouTube thank you guys for stopping by and I'll see you guys next time